I wanted to do something fun with my hair today. I'm also kind of trying to change my style up for something happening later on this year and y'all are going to freak out when you hear about it, but that's for another day. I just turned 19 years old four days ago. I still can't believe and wrap my head around the fact that I'm 19, but I vlogged the whole thing. I will link that video down below. I tried out the new Alani New Protein Shake flavor, Strawberry Shortcake, and I poured it over a glass of ice and it is phenomenal. Tastes exactly like a strawberry shortcake. So I'm gonna be sipping on that while I do a little haul of what I got for my 19th birthday. This video was super highly requested, so in no way, shape, or form am I trying to brag or make people feel a certain way. I'm just giving y'all what you want. Also, these are really good ideas if you're stuck on a good birthday gift or Christmas gift, keep watching. So to begin, I'm gonna start off with the gifts from my parents. First off, we've got this chocolate chip cookie mix. Great Harvest Co. It's a Boise locally owned company. They have the best treats and cookies ever and so my parents got me a chocolate chip cookie mix because they know i have the biggest sweet tooth ever and this is my favorite locally owned bakery so cannot wait to make these next my parents got me this cup from a place in austin texas el arroyo and it says be the person your dog thinks you are it's the cutest little mug ever i cannot wait i'm so excited if you're from texas you will automatically know what this is this next gift I screamed and my mom and dad told me that they are going to make this a tradition because last year was kind of the year where I first started receiving like big girl jewelry gifts. My parents got me a David Yurman ring for my 18th birthday and for my 19th birthday they got me a David Yurman bracelet. It is absolutely perfect. It fits me which is crazy because I never really wore a lot of bracelets just because my wrists are very very abnormally small but David Yurman has the best like customizable sizing and it's great for people who have very small wrists like me but this is so special I absolutely adore it and it's just beautiful there's a mix of silver and gold in this piece which perfectly describes me I love both silver and gold then my parents got me I think there's like 12 in here my mom accidentally ordered two packs it comes in four and she ordered like double that. These are customizable luggage tags. I'm gonna cover the bottom where my address is. Also excuse my horrible nails. I'm going to the nail salon literally tomorrow, but how cute are these? They are metal and it says M, Berline Manning, my address, my email, and then my phone number. This is great because I currently have a Southwest paper tag on. My other one broke and it comes with these little like metal things so it's never gonna fall off of your suitcase it's gonna be very secured and how cute and like bougie is this she told me it's from amazon then my parents got me a bunch of sterling silver spoons i love love dainty things like this i really appreciate the finer things in life like teacups and china and things like that sterling silver spoons key to my heart it was so so precious then of course my parents being the catholic biblical parents that they are they threw in some of these books this one says pillar of fire pillar of truth the catholic church it's like a catholic church book and then this one is called pure love I might have to take these on the plane they also got me this cute little book i love when they do things like this because this makes me still feel like a kid at heart. It's little quotes. But yeah, this one's called You're a Good Human. And it's just a really, really fun little read. My mom and dad wrote me the sweetest cards. And then my dad mailed a typed letter separately to me. Let me see if I have it. Oh yeah, it's right here. I was sobbing. I'll insert a video, but I was actually sobbing. It just... It just made my whole day and he knows I love letters in general and so the fact that you know he took the time to type one out for me and how thoughtful it was. If y'all could read it you would probably be in shambles too because I was a mess but seriously my mom and dad absolutely made me feel so special on my birthday and it was a treat itself having my mom be able to come up here and just spend like two weeks with me. Next up we've got Miss Rhonda and her family so they sent over the cutest little card ever with a birthday cake. For their gift, they sent over this candle, which is from one of my favorite candle brands in Dripping Springs, Texas, which is where I grew up. The actual brand is called Lubella Candle Co. And this scent is lavender. It smells amazing. I had a different scent when I first moved into this house. I made sure to burn it while I was like unpacking everything, moving in, and it made moving in so much more enjoyable. But yeah, this candle can burn for 120 hours, which is good because I love candles 
and yeah, they know. They know that I am a huge candle person. From my godparents, they took me out to dinner at this place called Alavita, downtown Boise. We had the best Italian food. I got this um, bolognese, like pasta bolognese. It was amazing. One of the things that my godparents have always done is make custom cards. So this was this year, so cute. And on the back, their last name is Hassler. And they said, Hassler Creations, sweet little message inside. The gifts were just the best. First, they got me an Amazon gift card. You can never go wrong with gift cards, especially from Amazon. So thank you for that. Then my godmother, Aunt Angie, is so, so talented. She does, I definitely am gonna butcher it, but she makes the cutest things in her little sewing room. So she does like cross stitching, regular sewing, putting together all of like old jeans and turning it into something amazing. And she made me these pot holders out of vintage jeans, like old jeans. And she turned it into these pot holders. I wish y'all could feel it because it is so, so soft and you can put it in the washer, you can dry it. The best gift that someone could probably give to me because I love things like this. I would buy this if this was in a store. And then another thing that she made, which is so special and I've never seen anything like this, is a custom bookmark for me. She literally stitched this together. I've never had a bookmark that looks like this. And so I can't wait to go to Barnes and Noble, crack open a new book and stick this right in there. Thank you so much Aunt Angie and Uncle Roger for my special gifts. You guys absolutely killed it. Oh, forgot to mention this. Last but not least from my parents, they gave me some socks from Dick's Sporting Goods because they know that I have been really into running lately. Not only do the right running shoes make the biggest difference, socks do as well. All of my socks are pretty thin they're not like thick material but this dick sporting goods material is really really good for running just so you know next up we've got a gift from my friend lex she made me feel so special i went out to dinner with her and my friend kaylee and first off how cute is this card the sweetest note inside and here is what she got me so first off these really cool shades i think i want to wear them out today even because it kind of like goes with this vibe that I've got going on. Very retro, cute glasses. Then she got me this adorable tan dress. Perfect for spring, since spring is coming up, and even summer. And also, I really, really enjoy dresses that are not just black and white because I only wear black and white clothes. It's kind of bad. So like I said, I've been trying to change up my wardrobe and this is the perfect thing ever because I can just totally see myself wearing this with a jean jacket. And then the last thing she got me is this purse, which I've never owned a purse like this before. It's like a jean material. Absolutely love it. And she was really smart with her gifting because I would wear this outfit together like this whole thing together i love smaller purses like this because they're perfect for just going out to a cute lunch date or something like that i have to hurry because my friend is on her way to pick me up right now okay Next up, we've got a gift from my Aunt April. My Aunt April and Uncle Hung, they live in Texas and they've been in a couple of my videos. They're literally my favorite people ever and her gifts also top tier. The gifts this year were just so, so sweet and thoughtful. We've got a cute little dog puzzle. It's a 99 piece dog stamp mini puzzle kit. Anybody that knows me knows that I love puzzles and I'm a sucker for puzzles. Then they got me this little pen set. This is the sunshine pen set and then there's three different pens, one of them says Says, bring on the sunshine the other one says sunset is my favorite color and the final one says stay golden I love writing in my planner I love journaling so this is perfect and then of course stationary to go with it this notepad says every day a badass babe so freaking cute and aesthetic thank you so much in April and uncle hung for that my auntie Phyllis who is also one of my favorite people in the whole world she sent over the sweetest card look at how cute this little dog is and she sent over some cash inside which she did not have to do but I can cannot wait to see her. I'm actually gonna see her very, very soon. And I just miss her all the time. She's a private pilot, so she's always on the go. But when I do get to see her, it's like all the time in between our last visit wasn't even that long. Next up, I spoiled myself. I don't think it's wrong to spoil yourself on your birthday because you're guaranteed to like the things that you're gonna pick out. And also it's just really fun. So I had a little bit of a splurge when I went shopping the other day. I went to Anthropology and Urban Outfitters. We're gonna start off with Anthropology. I've got this little hat. This is a trucker hat and how cute is this? The back says Coney Island. I'm not gonna put it on right now because it's gonna like mess up my hair, 
but y'all me in the summer on a lake either in a swimsuit or a cute little outfit wearing this so cute. Then I have this pair of white shorts. I never really invest in the shorts that I wear, but I invested in these suckers because this was pretty expensive, but it's very, very cute and I don't own anything like it. Preppy and I'm here for it. That's kind of the style that I'm going for. So really excited about these. They are so, so comfortable. Now onto Urban Outfitters. I got four pieces of clothing. How cute is this? This is another item of clothing that I don't have anything like. It's almost like a burlap knit on the top and then a moss green fabric on the bottom. It's so, so cute. I'm 100% going to be wearing this every day of summer. To kind of go with that, I bought shorts that have that same knit material. These are gonna be really good as swimsuit cover-up shorts. Could even be pajama shorts or just going out shorts. And I am actually obsessed. I've never owned anything like that before. Then I got a cute little top. When I go to Europe, I'm going to be wearing this. There's strings in the front and it's kind of like flowy at the bottom. Picture this with blue flare bell-bottom jeans, hair up in a ponytail or in curls. It's giving stage coach. And then the last thing that I bought for myself are these flowy pants that remind me of Jasmine, the Disney princess. They're so, so cute and bohemian. I don't really have clothes that are bohemian style, but I'm excited to wear this and it's so, so stretchy and soft. That is everything that I got for my 19th birthday. It was probably one of the best birthdays of my life. I feel like I say that every year, but seriously, I'm so grateful for all the people that I'm surrounded by and just the amazing things that happened when I was 18 and the amazing things that are gonna happen when I'm 19. So if you guys like today's video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, don't do anything. The strawberry shortcake protein shake is so good. You have to try it out. But yeah, I love y'all so much and I will see you in my next video. Ciao.